breaking news here. Uh, NASA's Fermi Telescope has found a humongous structure in the middle of our galaxy. Uh, NASA's Fermi uh, Gamma Ray Space Telescope, it, it looks for gamma rays, uh, gamma ray emitting uh, structures, ha has found a, a 50,000 light year long structure uh, that they believe may be the remnant of an eruption of a supersized black hole, possibly, at the center of our galaxy. Um, possibly from millions of years ago. They're not thinking billions, they don't know how old these things are, but if you're looking at that picture right there, that picture was released by NASA today um, to show the uh, size of these. The, uh, the, what they say they're seeing is two gamma ray emitting bubbles that are 25,000 light years north and 25,000 light years south of the center of our galaxy, of the Milky Way galaxy, which is a spiral galaxy, which is about half the um, which is about half of the Milky Way's diameter. So these guys take up about half the visible sky. Um, they stretch from the constellation Virgo to the constellation Grus. Gamma rays are not normally this visible, but these bubbles have very defined edges, which causes scientists to believe they were created by very rapid high energy explosions, you know, probably from a supernova of a black hole. Uh, gamma rays are actually the highest energy X ray, anyways. Uh, and th which are electromagnetic energy, like all X-rays. Uh, who knows, you know, w what they come from, or why they're here, or what their purpose is, or what we can use them for. Um, but the more information comes in, the more I'll let you know. Uh, subscribe and take.